Sri Lanka, a rapidly developing nation and a catalyst for growth and a prime leader in exports. From its humble beginnings to the present, Sri Lanka has established a hallmark in the export of one of the world's largest industries. Salon Tea revolutionized the tea industry and with it came a golden opportunity for printing and packaging. Today, Sri Lanka is home to a booming print and packaging industry where some of the world's biggest tea brands have moved their packaging activities to. With a single company producing more than 100 million tea bag tags and tea envelopes a day, this is a notable feat. Sri Lanka boasts an atmosphere of history in art, culture and creativity shaping industries, people, and the nation as a whole. Being situated in the middle of the Indian Ocean, its prime location has aided it becoming a hub for printing and packaging services among global clients. Having developed connectivity in both sea and air services, it has become an international hub for the printing industry, making imports and exports to the globe faster and more efficient. With the printing industry starting off in the 18th century through European involvement and modern-day exports having been initiated in the 1980s, there has been significant growth and advancement. Today, Sri Lanka is home to over 4,000 printing organizations. Sri Lanka's print industry succeeds on many grounds with the latest technology, quality service levels, evolving infrastructure, global standards, strong government assistance, low operating costs, and a skilled labor force. Well, Sri Lanka has been concentrating on the technological aspects of packaging and much investment has gone into the technology, particularly because uh, we not only the machinery, right, the finishing, right, all aspects as required uh, by the international standards. Sri Lanka has total solution for packaging, which includes mainly uh, flexible packaging, offset packaging, and what we have uh, corrugated packaging for large packages. Sri Lankan printers have always focused on value addition. From the time the customer gives us a design, our, our real focus is how do we make the vision of the customer and the brand manager really stand out on the shelf. Whether that be hot foil, cold foil, lamination, special effects on cartons and labels, our focus is really how do we differentiate our customers' products. The Sri Lankan print industry is truly versatile. We can focus on one end on larger runs uh, with higher efficiencies and uh, shorter lead times and at the same time we can also focus on more value-added niche products that we work very closely with the customer to design and this versatility really uh, is exemplified through the different capacities of the different printers in this country. Uh, Sri Lanka's strategic location, efficient port and low cost of manufacturing over here made it a perfect choice to set up a flexible packaging plant here especially if you're targeting export business. We do a lot of value addition here. We buy plain unprinted polyester, BOPP, yeah. aluminum foil and other metalized films. We print them, laminate them, convert them into pouches, bags, tea envelopes and finished roll stocks for our customers. I hope Sri Lanka print industry uh, grow and profit more and more uh, for the future. Specifically speaking, the packaging segment on paper boards and on other substrates like flexography printing has tremendously improved and my feeling is it, it is no way inferior to anywhere in the world. Sri Lankan print can compete anywhere in the world today. If I compare this to the international countries, I'm traveling a lot to many of the, re of the regions, if I compare the quality to Europe, US, and other Asian countries, uh, I would say you are there. Uh, you are definitely doing the same great job as the others. There's no difference in quality. There's no difference in design. There's no difference 
in what you want to say with the samples uh, to your customers. Sri Lanka can be proud of a 93% literacy rate that brings the industry a skilled labor force who work with the utmost dedication to deliver results and enhance the printing industry. Sri Lanka Association of Printers started 1956 as an FX body in Sri Lanka representing printing fraternity and we have printers scattered island wide small, medium and large. According to our survey, our printers has state-of-the-art machinery to produce high-quality print items and meet the demand. Institutes such as the Sri Lanka Institute of Printing, Sri Lanka Print Media Academy and the Ingrin Institute of Printing and Graphics have been set up to educate and provide proper training for labor and young recruits in order to keep the industry on par with global standards, techniques and skills. Sri Lanka's printed goods have reached a significant range of markets across the globe, pushing our standards and growth. The major exported printed goods from Sri Lanka fall under three distinct categories, stationery, packaging and publication. These exports have reached countries such as Sweden, the USA, France, Switzerland, Australia, Canada, Singapore, India, the UAE, the United Kingdom, Germany, Venezuela, Maldives and so on. When it comes to the publishing market, so which is a very larger segment of print, uh, there are magazines to periodicals to various publications all over the world under this category. Sri Lanka once used to be called Ceylon and our biggest export and the, the product that we were known around the world for was our tea. And our packaging industry really grew around that. We supplied world-class packaging to our tea industry and soon we realized that we could actually be supplying world-class packaging to the world. From tea we moved to apparels and now to many other packaging industries such as FMCG and pharmaceuticals. And really the know-how we've developed over 30 years has held us in good stead. Stationery is another large segment of the print market. Starting from the simple excise book to notebook, there are many things uh, in this area. So this kind of stationery items uh, are part of uh, the publication area stationary area also can create some niches. The printing industry of Sri Lanka believes in consistent, stringent quality standards to qualify for receiving orders to enter global competition. This drives anyone and everyone within the industry to effectively synchronize its systems, processes, people and technologies to deliver the highest levels of quality. The top printers comply with globally recognized, responsible environmental and ethical standards, giving them the capacity to conform with global standards. The printing industry of Sri Lanka offers an opportunity for green or eco-friendly products. Many top printers in the industry have taken measures toward sustainability and offer green printing processes at very attractive rates to the global market adhering to the highest world-class quality standards. Running our business in a sustainable manner has always been a key priority to packaging companies in Sri Lanka. It's not just about being green. It's about looking at the little impacts that we have in every activity that we do in our business and finding out a way to do it in a less harmful way to the environment. We've for a long time been measuring our impact and we've put in place a lot of processes that help mitigate that impact. Possessing the necessary technological advancements with each passing day, the industry works towards being the printing hub of South Asia. Sri Lanka has already claimed a position in different segments of the world through exporting, printing and packaging. This mission serves as a driving force for its top printers, making it their vision for a stronger, better, efficient and productive future.